I was that little girl. I was the last one in a family of nine. So growing up, I was very inquisitive. I was observing a lot of the things around me and I just had a lot of questions. And I never was able to get to the answers. Of course, you know, some of those questions got even saved out. And then I kept continuing to answer the questions, got into university and all of that. Again, I got married and I had two years of very toxic marriage. Within that two years, I had two kids. I got married in 2010. And then I realized in 2013 that uh, divorce, I had to just leave this marriage if I'm, if I'm going to be alive, literally. And I left. So I left with two children. My response to that pain was to dive in into, again, Christian asking and observing that what is life about? What is all of this? And then I started, you know, consulting a lot of books, the Bible, books, books, books. And, you know, something that anything that would just teach me what life is about, how to guarantee success or you know what determines failure because i remember one of those questions i was asking growing up was god why, why would you bring people on earth to just suffer why would you bring people on earth and then they're living their lives like a gamble god is is one very structured intentional person so that question came back again and then i joined the john maxwell team along the line i heard the world neurolinguistic programming and i was like what is that i went to the internet i found what it was about i researched and then i looked for a provider in nigeria doesn't mind talk so it was in june 2018 i i took because then i was still i, still, I was still working i was still doing eight to five so i jumped the aircraft had to took a one week leave and i went to abuja and then i appeared in class hungry it was like i had those goals i had those questions but i didn't have a tool I didn't have a tool to even believe in myself enough that the things I was hearing, I was learning, that it made sense. I didn't know that it was a body of work that would literally teach you what life is about, how to create success, predictable success in life. I didn't know. So I was I was reading those things. I was meditating on those things. But it didn't quite make sense because they were just the opposite of the things, all of the, almost the opposite of all of the things I have known up until then. I remember I, I sent a text to my family uh, I left, you know, I left, I left that class totally changed. I got back and I left my 8 to 5 job. It's been a Macarius consultant, which, which literally was like a vision I had as a small child. And I'll tell you totally that the learnings that I've gotten in NLP as taught by Mr. Usa, those were the foundational blocks that has helped in every other thing we do. And then when we say that we do psychology mystery, it was because of my exposure the sort of work that Mr. Usa knows. I was healed of my lack of alignment when it comes to money making and money management. The NLP as taught by Mr. Usa will never leave you where he meant you. And I'll tell you that even if you've done that course with him and you go back two years later, it's like a different layer of who you are will be revealed. Life is a lot more easier now. I've been able to go through that entire divorce process, healing process, Having two wonderful children that are doing amazing, I'm so proud of them. Building a phenomenal company, Macarius Consulting Services. It's been 10 years of, I mean, post us down and then NLP coming in along the line. It's been growth. It's been a revelation of brighter, better, more beautiful, more loving, more aligned. Winning me, NLP was that one answer had every other thing really attached so i would say that beyond being born again the next most important thing that happened to me and for me was meeting with Sir and his body of work in the program and in big house company